Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new little series or mini-series on God of Weapons, an inventory managing horde survival roguelike that I'm excited to be checking out again here today. We got so many characters and even like subclasses to check out here. It's kind of looking at this golden knight here, the weapon master. We gain attack speed for every unique weapon in our inventory, can't equip ranged weapons, and things are a little bit more expensive. So we're going to be kind of looking to just cram as many small weapons in our inventory as possible, I would assume. So I'll go with the short sword, takes up the least space. Starting item, tattered banner, adjacent weapons give two armor, adjacent armor items give two melee. Okay, and then we're going to be going for Calamity 2, because I saw somebody takes, if we win on this, we unlock a specific character. Enemies are stronger, new elites appear, new enemies appear, and Zor the Overlord appears so in we're gonna go i did you may notice that you can actually see the game now that is because there is a nice brightness setting uh thank god that actually lets you see the enemies and see the game that you're playing instead of having to guess um which genuinely it changes so much god i'm really we have a, a penalty to our attack speed at the get-go that was nice until we get our second weapon Okay, one, two, a three, a four. I mean, we should probably shouldn't get the, the, the biggest thing I've ever seen there. We could get the great axe, but it feels like that uh, one damage for every 20 kills with this weapon seems ideal. So we got that. Five recovery minus two movement speed. I feel like I don't need it. Could I lock the... Combat X, bonus damage for each adjacent. I could, but let's just let's just keep vibing. We don't have very much money, things being like a little bit more expensive. But also, I think that we're gonna wanna find like I don't know, I'm sure there's like small hand axes and maybe other small swords and stuff. I know there's fist weapons, those surely can't be that big. Oh, invincibility, nice. Love that find another crate it can be items it can be explosives get in there just go for it you got to keep in mind though that whatever your health is at at the end of the wave it actually stays there which is oh what's that prism blade ooh. dagger adjacent weapons have an extra 15 percent chance to trigger lifesteal on kill and then there's another small weapon here i think i'm gonna like lock all that stuff Fill up the space. We could buy two if we went for uh, this. Oh. oh, it's five across. Oh, that actually, <laughs> that actually messes things up. That, <laughs> that actually messes things up that's five across. Unless I don't. I could just not have that when it uh, be touching it for now. That's fine by me. And then we'll just lock this one. So all of these are touching. Oh, this does um this doesn't scale on melee damage. This scales on magic. That makes sense. It looks magical, but I guess we'll have it for now. But we should we should replace it because clearly we're gonna want to go for like cohesive stuff. Ooh, it looks cool. All right, just like that, I'm, I'm starting to attack super fast. Should have saved that invincibility. Just happened to pick it up. Oh, well. Looking for another crate. Yeah, we. I feel like a lot stronger. Like, a lot stronger already. Look around and vibe. I think, yeah, going for like an attack speed angle with all this. Or a uh, lifesteal and attack speed angle here would be pretty smart. This is three. So if we could... It's not worth re-rolling, I don't think. But now it is. Come on. Come on. Alright, so we can I'm sure we can find a different way to do this. We can obviously get it in there, but it's not gonna be touching this. 
But we can't have everything touch it anyways. But we should try and at the very least have this touching as many as possible. Uh, what I want to do, I think if we go for like this, that, um, take it out. Boop. No. We can go for something like that. That works out pretty well, actually. It works out fine. It doesn't work out great. We could, uh, whoop, 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 whoop. And if this one's not touching that, it's just like, oh, God, that's so, okay. It's getting so fiddly already. The thing is, I can't fit this in here anyways. I wouldn't want it anyways. I don't think I'd take that anyways. I think we just say, sure, and we move on. But we're going to want to, like I said, replace this magic sword at some point, even though it's really cool. And boy, it is really cool. Doesn't make sense if we're going to be focusing on the melee damage. It's nice that we get all the free armor for taking for taking these melee weapons too. Invincibility. Invincibility go ham. Feels like you should mostly take your invincibility towards the other like barrels and such. Whoop. What do we got? Uh, we already have that one. We do not have this. We have two spaces. This takes up uh it takes up a lot, so that's not going to happen. But I could... What is this? This is when consumed, restore 40% health. Our enemies on the next floor. I could go for that anyways. I could sell this, get the, um, the small axe... It's sad, because it is very cool, but we also need to adjust that. But we have four spaces. We'll keep that in mind. Uh, we already have one of those daggers. Doesn't mean we can't get another. It just means that we're not really looking for another one of the same right now. Don't have this one, do we? Nope. Bonus crit chance for each adjacent dagger. Up, 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 up. Surely there's a good way to do this. So if we go for... Oh my god, I hate that we can't... Ah, okay. If we buy that, pop that there, that's tapping so many there. But then we have the four. That, that makes this not work. We don't have any clean place to put that until we do something with this. There we go. This is only touching three right now. It could be touching a lot more, but I think we just say okay. We already have the ebony dagger. All right, what do we have for attack speed? We're at 100 attack speed, just like that. Just like that. But yeah, a little bit of lifesteal would go a long way since we're attacking so fast. And the way that lifesteal works in this is the same as Brotato. It is a percentage on uh, on hit to lifesteal. I can definitely tell how much more health these guys have. Oh my word. But we are attacking so fast that it doesn't even matter. There's new bomb enemies. I'm seeing them. They're, they're definitely different. Ooh. Extremely long sword. All right, let's get a little bit more height after that feels uh, apt. Fire mace. Surely, surely there's a way I can get that in there, right? Wait. Oh, it's 50% melee, 50% elemental or magic anyways, so not sure that I care. It's more that, like, let's see. We could probably find something else more exciting. Combat axe. I'm going to put that out for a second. 
it's four spaces. We have four spaces left. So theoretically, oh, wait, why did I think that we had enough space if we did that? Nope. Mm, this is, this is weird. Oh, life stealing. Unfortunately, due to the nature of what these ones are, I think we have like a weird sort of situation. Um, it's another four or is this five? It's a five. Can I get this down here? Ah, it's making me so mad. All right. Uh, because I want to. I want to slot that down one. Freaking slide puzzle. Just let me. Let me put two things outside of my inventory. Like, so that I don't rip my hair out. Okay. So there's nothing we can do with a two space. There's just nothing we can do with a two space with the weapons that we have. If I put the axe there. Okay. Then if we do this. It's going to be fine but then we have that one empty space which is an absolute killer for us we can't have a one empty space if we want to fit that sword in upsetting oh wait i think i've done it he's a god inventory god inventory god online uh there's no reason to get anything else no reason to roll I need, I need life stealer survivability though. Like, hopefully we get lucky and we get a crate that actually has uh, healing in it, because that is currently our only source of survivability is like getting lucky with crates. Whoop. We have armor, so we do take less damage. Man, everything is so much tankier already. We're only on difficulty level two. Like, hopefully it's not. Um, just going to be health and stuff. All right. Nasty. We're super close to another level up. We did not get it. Uh, is this a... Oh, that's a weapon. Two spaces. Oh, it takes four. I'll lock that. Vitality and recovery minus luck. I'll buy that for the time being. Shield and armor. Ideally, we want to extend this up so that we have, like, the top doing, like, what we're doing here. Because then we get so much armor. We have 12, which only reduces damage taken by 12. If I put this in, it blocks 5 damage. But it also gives me 2 flat melee, which I am lacking. What the hell? Bonus attack speed when not moving. No, you can't combine weapons in this. That takes up probably too much space to be worth it. One, two, three, four, five, six. I feel like six is too much. Five is already pushing it. I have so much money. What do we got there? Melee power. Flat melee. Oh. Uh, say less survivability never heard of it i prefer life steal over recovery anyways since we attack so fast and we'll probably ditch it the second we get um wait do we have do we have life steal we're he we are healing okay so there's food on the ground there for if we ever need it we want to be a little bit more uh, stationary than we have been being on this way. I mean, like, moving towards the um, the crates is a good call. Invincibility. Nice. Go ham. Go ham. Now get ham. Peasy. Next. Whoop. Whoop. Surely it's melee damage. Yes, sir. Upgrade a weapon to the next tier. Uh, 
Hello. Hmm. Oh, yeah. That's right. Lifesteal 1%. Oh, we have 1% lifesteal from some. Why do we have 1% lifesteal at all? Is that just what we have at the beginning? Didn't even change that. Okay. Is this... Uh, oh, that's another, that's another weapon. I'll lock that. Takes up two space. Attack speed. Crit chance attack speed. It's not bad. I just don't think I need it. Short sword. I'm not really going for any things that I already have. Next. I just know how run like runs take so long now. So I'm going to... I'm going to go for it. After that first episode, we know that things could just, like, we could be here forever. But it's also a nice uh, run because the game plan for this character is a little bit more straightforward. It's kind of just, uh, get as many weapons as possible. Pretty, pretty clean and straightforward. The invincibility kit, get the big boys with that. I would love some more flat melee damage, which, again, we could get by grabbing armor and putting it by our, uh... Our little thing. But I kind of like the idea of just having a bunch of the armor anyways. Like, lots of attack speed, lots of armor. I don't like that the HP stays between waves. <laughs> like, I'd prefer it didn't. Yeah. I'm gonna say... Attack speed's up to 179! Oh my... Crit chance minus life steal, resource gain, move speed luck. I'll lock that, I guess. That's the fist we already have. Experience gain, that's more um more spaces. That's basically, yep. That's the thing. I was looking for the anvil. That might be worth. Just gonna focus focus the single thing because I'm less likely I could find an epic or, or a, a rare it's unlikely like I can but it's unlikely that I'll find another thing so it's the fist weapon right just making sure Whoop, we got 450 bucks still Lo oh a long sword wait this is different adjacent armor gives you two extra armor I don't have a long sword that takes up five spaces though I don't know man I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Boop, 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 boop. It also, like, I think that just locking a bunch is just... The existence of the anvil and literally how broken it is... Is probably reason enough to, like, single-handedly reason enough to make you not want to lock in the shop really that much. So I should definitely clear out some of that stuff. Okay. Do some dodging. Whoop, 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 whoop. Good. Okay, there's an upgrade of that. So we are looking for what? I guess probably extending out up top, I guess. I will buy that. Neither of these take up four, so it's not a good call. We sell the sickle, take the just better sickle. And then we decide which one of these we'd rather have. I think I'd rather go for... I mean, I'm not going for the armor. One, two, three, four. I know that this has this bonus damage for every sword of the inventory, but it's also just not that much. Oh, that's the one we already have. Health gain per four, experience gain. I mean, I do like that. I'm going to meet in the middle. What do we got here? Very large. Four melee power, minus three luck. I want that so bad. But do I take it? I don't know. I'll lock it. We have so much money. And so little interest in any of this trash. Movie speed of life, sealed luck. I do want that. I'll tell you what. I'll lock it and I'll figure it out. I know that's what I said about the anvil, but we'll lock it for the beginning of the next floor. 
and then we'll figure it out. I think this is an elite. He is so tanky. Oh my word. Give me invincibility, please. Did I get the elite? I think I got him. Okay, there's a meat right there. Don't take it until we need it. AKA, don't take it until like the last five seconds. Keep on breaking those things. There's more meat. More meat. Good. A hefty, hefty, hefty uh, floor here. I guess it's because it's the elite wave. Floor 10. It's supposed to be like a moment of truth moment. All right. Uh, one. Uh, sure. A two. A three. A four. Just with the stuff we have, I feel like... <laughs> For some reason, I feel like that's going to be useful. Maybe, maybe not. I guess for the hammer, that for the hammer, it doesn't make any sense. Melee power will go so far for us. You know what? <laughs> I don't care. We'll grab that. Pocket watch. Let's see if, is there any, oh, yep, that's the one. Pop that out. Get the anvil. Upgrade. Oh, hey, look at that. Bonus life steal if not placed near another life stealing weapon. Well, hey. I'll do that and then I'll readjust. Surely we can make that work. <sighs> With a lot of effort. Wait. No, it's actually with no effort whatsoever. Bada bing, bada boom. We've done it. It's not near another life-stealing weapon, right? Fist and Agile. Agile Swift. Okay, good. All right. Live and learn. Can't believe Streamer didn't do that. I just downloaded this game the other day, man. <laughs> just please. Okay. Uh, Kind of just fishing for Anvil because it is that broken. Two armor. I don't really care. Is this an epic? It is. Love it. It's good enough for me. Should probably unlock that other axe. Woo! Woo, Nelly! Doing damage. We should have, like, much better lifesteal now because of that. It's more noteworthy, yeah. Uh, it was already pretty good. We have so much armor, too. Probably just do standstill kill business. We got an invincibility. I'll use it when I feel like I need it. I guess I'll... I guess I'll take it. Walk to another crate. Just using it to freely walk to another crate is pretty much good enough. Invincibility, good. Next, one level up. Am I using this hammer? We got. We got to know. I'll start I'll start working my way there. How about that? Epic fist. Sure. Jousting light. It's huge. Luck and crit chance. I do hate that I have that thing there. Resource gain, minus range. I don't really want minus range. Attack speed up. Experience gain, minus resource gain. I'm gonna say sure. Experience gain is more level up tiles. Actually, screw it. We'll just take more melee damage. A little bit less attack, or, uh, uh, attack speed, but like we have so much attack speed that we can absolutely afford to get rid of some. Hey, you. Get out of my face. Blast them. Yeah, we're doing we're doing pretty good damage. Things were spookier in the beginning for sure. I'm definitely seeing a couple new enemies. 
They were spookier in the beginning for sure due to the uh, uh, invincibility. The tier 2 of it all. Tier 2 difficulty of it all. I don't remember what that one is. I don't know if I know. Is it a damage upgrade? Perhaps. It looks like a shield. But it there already is a shield in the game. Healing on that one. We got money. Give me the healing. All right. Uh, projective power. No, no care. Sure. I don't know what the plan is with that one, but. Oh, God. What am I doing? Yeah, that was not. That wasn't it. I'm sure we can figure it out. In fact, we can probably, like, finally even adjust this better to get yet another thing going. Oh, dope. Almost on that one. We, if I would have thought that one, preemptively thought that one through a little bit better. Uh, Hold on. That. A little bit of that for now, I guess back put that back put that there expert management basically just looking for literal obvious upgrades or i think it's crazy melee power minus life seal no well i, mean, I guess i'll put it in here looking for anvil right like that's just the answer Definitely ditch that. Did I um, did I mess this up? It's not by a life. No, it's not. Not by a life seal weapon. Whoop. And belt. What is this thing? I oh, know. No, that's the. You are basically dead. You're fine. Okay. After locking that for a million years, we just get a better one right away. Anyways. <laughs> okay. Gotcha. Uh, loud and clear. Screw me. Do we have one of these? We do. We have a better version of it. Next. Perfect. Oh my my. Oh my my. Doing some murders. Yeah, we got it. We keep getting a lot stronger. Okay, the lifesteal is... Yeah, the lifesteal is looking good too. Thank God. I'm not going to say we can handle anything because it seems like the damage increase is pretty disgusting on some of these guys, but we have created a monster. Oh, yeah, no. See, that that's the thing. is I was starting to say something because these bullets from these guys are terrifying. And we actually, we're hurting. We're hurting a lot. Yeah, that's actually pretty annoying. Hmm. All right, maybe we're actually going to die. I take it back. Okay, so we're obviously going to upgrade that. So, sell. Upgrade. Attack speed, crit chance, minus move speed. I'll take it for the time being. Item price is an idea. This is stacked up however many. Enemies kill this weapon. So the base damage is up by five. Is the attack speed better or anything? Is there anything else better on it? Attack speed, 0.63. Yeah, it's better then. It's better to go for it. Because that one has been stacking up very well. So it's like, it's not as obvious of an upgrade as uh, as normal. I mean, I mean, yeah. I'll take that. We already got that one. Permanently increase the stat. We do have to drag something out to use it. Sure. Uh, 
All right. One moment. Here we go. We... I'm not going to say we're in a great spot anymore. We are missing... Ooh, missing some HP. We're on an elite. That's not good either. We got these homing sons of guns. We got a bunch of barrels, though, maybe. Maybe that'll help. Oh! Oh! Okay, this is... St <laughs> this got stressful. This got stressful. Dodging through, though. Uh, why they gotta be homing, though? Why they gotta be homing, though? I can't even tell if I killed the freaking elite. I'm pretty sure I did. I feel like I'd be uh, more upset if I didn't. So, when are there elites? So, there's obviously one on floor 10. Or maybe it's bro... I mean... I could, should probably just assume everything is brotato style until I see otherwise. What we got there? Move speed and an extra dash would actually be really nice. We have enough money to reroll these. Okay. Uh, fancier Warhammer. I think we do that. We don't have this sword. Do we? We don't have a long we don't have a long sword. I think I locked that for later. Move speed resource gain. We'll get the move speed in the dash, mostly for the dash. I uh, I just don't have, sp have space for that, man. I could also If I put this out here, we have four. If we sold something like I guess it would be this. If we sold this, we could... Mm. I could almost place this hammer. If I put one space right here, I could place this hammer here uh, sideways. And then we'd have perfectly optimal tattered banner, which would be really nice. Because this could be in their diagonal, so we just need to remember to put one space there. One, two, three, four. Yeah, one space there. Um... But as far as getting that sword in there right now, I guess I could get rid of the pocket watch. I don't think I need it. So now, that's the thing. It's like, you sell it. It's not good, probably, to do sell first questions later. But uh, I do think that we should be able to find a way to fit it in now, at the very least. If we do this, we could pop that in here. Because it's got five spaces. Let me, let me just pause and do this. All right. There we go. I did sell the boots, but I, I'm just I'm just okay with that. Oh, boy. For each adjacent pole arm. I don't have very many pole arms. It's also so... It takes up so much space. Resource gain. I do have a one-slot little bop there. Okay, 4% lifesteal. I think that that is something I should go for. What do we got here? Move speed, lifesteal, melee power. I feel like I want to keep the melee power. As far as things to remove, I'd have to remove, like, the three melee power for it. I don't love it. I don't love doing that, but I am going to do it. And then I, I guess I'm just going to leave it empty. I don't have to, but I, I'm going to. Getting all that extra life steal, like we we attack so fast that that just feels very useful. Okay, we got a bunch of projectiles, like just like so many projectiles coming out of that man. Okay, but he's dead. Okay, our damage is definitely gnarly. Feels like we're weirdly safe if we actually just move right in the middle of a big clump. I think from the armor and the life steal. The time when things get really bad for us is when we kind of play it in the middle of like, eh, I can't go in, so I'm going to not go in. Okay, we're invincible. This, In this situation, you go crazy. You just go ham. But yeah, like if we just move right into the middle, it seems like there's not contact damage, oh, thankfully, which is really, 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 really nice. 
Okay, what do we got here? I, the ritual doll is tempting, but also I hate it. Hmm. I want that spot. Okay. Okay. Because I have ruined it now, though. It's a really good way. I can also get one here. I'm spending too many rerolls on this. And now I might as well, like, turn that into something. When we could just technically do that. Um, this is a five. It's a five. Can't slot that in there. We would need a four. The Warhammer is kind of a four. Let's put that out for a second. Because that we could, we could technically do it. We have, literally do have the space for it. This, this was a mistake. Oh, my lord. I mean, that technically is already on paper good enough. That, I mean, that works for me. We actually have a good place for, uh, well, I guess with those, the axe is not that shape, is it? No. Tried it. I'm not fitting the trident in there, man. I could get another Warhammer. What the hell is this? 10 luck, 2 crit chance to resource gain. I feel like, oh, that is a thing. Wait. Oh, shoot. Okay. That's good. But also, oof. Does this help me in any way? Not really. Life, if not placed by another life seal weapon, I need to make sure I don't ruin that. First things first. Oh, Tetris. It's not by another life seal item. I don't think that's not life seal, right? Correct. So that has to be like that. Okay. This is super close to being right. I could obviously just sell the life steel glove and like bada bing bada boom, we're fine. I just feel like there's a better way to do that. Crit for each Jason dagger. That's working right. I feel like this should be swapped. But this is uh oh god, it's not adjacent to something on this side. Huh. We should be able to. We should be able to fix that, right? Surely. Surely. There we go. Okay, fixed. It sucks, because we have the space. I think I would just have to do some colossal uh, backpack jujitsu in a way that I don't, don't feel like doing. Mainly power... Four life steal, minus one dodge chance. Ooh. That's a lot of attack speed, melee power. It's also reduce the um. I just screw it. I just it's too much. <laughs> I'm looking for like a one-off thing, or I guess upgrades to daggers. I have that one upgrade already, or anvils, of course. Good deal. I wish it was like a little bit more obvious when they were um, higher tiers, you know? Okay. D goodbye, sir. I do got to see what my life, my, uh, my, what tax speed is at now. I know my life still is not great. It's probably under 10. One would assume. But we also have a million freaking weapons going crazy. There's Ratman! I'm invincible. Okay. Look for crates. Yeah. Yeah. I've become quite destructive. Quite, quite destructive. But I'm not invincible. Somebody's, I think, 
there's a dashing unit that's running? No, it's the bullets. It's the bullets. The bullets are ruining me. So we should go towards the Spider-Man. What's that? Eh, I just don't care. <laughs> I don't need more money, really. I know that's, like, stupid, but it's true. There we go. That helps a lot. Get the life steal for sure. I just don't. What's that? Five percent damage, attack speed, move speed, dodge change, vitality, luck recovery. I mean, that's a lot of stuff. I do just want the life steal gloves kind of over it. If I'm gonna be honest, it's also very expensive. It's very expensive for what actually doesn't sound very exciting. I'm... Yeah, I'm gonna pass. It's not that it's not good, I just like... Ugh, it just seems... Ugh. Finding a lot of these now. This is... A weapon I don't have that only is a four slot. That's worth locking. Getting armor is another good angle, but we have so much armor already... What is it? Five armor minus four vitality. We could. It's an upgrade to our claw. Attack speed for every blank kills. I mean, that's fine. All right, let's save. Four sixteen. Whoop. Okay. Yeah, when we have the big clumps, especially like these slimes here, things go pretty good for us. We just gotta save our dash for the bullet boys. Oh, that was not good. That was not good. Kaboom. I do love the explosive barrels. I love all the barrels, I guess, but like... There's so, so little pomp and circumstance with the uh, the projectiles. Like, there's no sound effects, which I guess could get very annoying if there was a lot, but it's just so easy for them to get lost in the crowd. Whoop. See, uh, yeah. Could you see them? Sure. A little late, though. Kaboom. Get in there, get in there, get in there. All right, um... Oh, I do like that. So we're looking for a four. Oh, we have six spaces? Wait, what? In that case... Zoop. Zoop. That sounds nice. We have a little bit of leeway. What is that? The, uh... It's the get a random stat. Basically trade 260 whatever for a random stat. We got a little bit of move speed. Don't mind if I do. Fist. Anvil. My favorite. Let's upgrade a, uh... Let's upgrade something that's touching here. Go for that. Could I get another... Anvil. No, okay. <laughs> I, everything I have is... Sure. We'll keep that. We'll keep that around. A little bit more luck. Get some more rare stuff. Everything I have is blue tier or higher, which is pretty cool. Floor 18 feels like a place you'd find an elite because... Floor 19 doesn't. Knowing that... Yeah, I was going to say. Considering that floor 20 is the last... That's pretty telling. That's a dead elite right there. Ooh, that's too many. It's too many of those. It's too many of those. They're all shooting projectiles, the, the werewolves. Okay. I think what it is is, like, there's a lack of enemy sound, just in general. Okay, we're invincible. That's beautiful. Love to see that right now. The rare time where you get a dash into enemies. 
Okay, explosive barrel, watch out. Love it. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're in the clear. Okay, we got an upgrade to that. Love it. I should have <laughs> paid attention to uh, how many we had. I've been getting so many of them. I'm not going to be able to fit that in in time. Fine. Zoop. So we can fit a twofer. What's that? Projectile power? Don't care. Projectile power? Don't care. More life steal? Sure. I mean, there's a world we fit that in on the next one. <laughs> sure. Love the dragon blood elixir. We're at how much? 12% life steal. Luck is in the negative. That's fine. It doesn't seem like it really makes a difference. I'm going to be real. 300% attack speed. Yep. 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 Loving that. No. Oh. Bonus space damage while standing still. Armored. I mean, yeah, there's some cool stuff going on with that. I just don't think I'm gonna. Ain't fitting that in in time. Some flat melee power. You know what? Sure. Sure. We have 19 here. One more. Got a weird screen flash there. Oh, there is an elite on this wave, and he sucks. Oh, he can just like he's ja he can just die. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I don't. Considering that this is level two, I'm terrified to see what they think is a fun level five. You know what I'm saying? Like it's not bad right now, but I am also unbelie well unbelievably busted, and I'm also getting kind of close to dying. Invincibility, love it. I have no idea what we're dealing with for the next boss. More invincibility, absolutely love it. I do want to do, like, maybe there's a character one day for it, but uh, a barrel build, because there's that item that, like, spawns more barrels, and you can just get invincibility. Could you theoretically just be invincible the whole time? One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. Uh, no, it's the wrong way. Okay. Oh, uh, shoot. <laughs> it's the wrong way. Okay, um, so if we do it like this, that should be fine. Zoop. Bada bing, bada boom. I can't believe we fit it. That is a half melee, half uh, magic anyways. What the hell's that? 16% move speed? That actually seems so useful. Is it more useful than the stuff we have? It's always hard to tell. I'm going to maybe just, at this point, I guess, just roll and fish for, eh, like an anvil. 4% life steal. If I could ditch that to get it, I would, but I can't. Ooh. Too late, probably, right? Oh, no, I can, I can get that. Attack speed up for each bonus move speed. Range for each or for each negative move speed. Oh boy. I I have a decent amount. Alright, let's roll to see what we don't get, because this is the final wave. Alright, big boy boss. So the thing with this that's different than uh Brotato is. Oh boy. We do have to finish the wave after we kill the boss. So we can't just only rush the boss. Um, that's some stupid stuff there. That... That is really stupid. What? The hit scan, screen-wide, full-piercing 
attacks? Not a fan of that. Believe it or not. All of that just for one boss that is does that is crazy to me, but okay. All right. That's God of Weapons. <laughs> Will we be back tomorrow? We shall see. That's some malarkey. Oh my goodness. Uh <laughs> Yeah, we'll see. We'll back we're back tomorrow. I don't know. Let me know in the form of a comment down below. I'll see how I feel. That was a lot. A long run for such a quick death with so much armor. So much armor. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. Check the channel for roguelikes and more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.